Alright, hey guys, how's everyone doing today? As always, I'm Epic Luca, and today I am playing Digimon Rumble Arena on the PS1. Been wanting to do this one for quite some time. Don't know don't know why I held off, probably because it was an arcade episode, and I like to space them out a little bit, but no, today I'm actually going at it solo and gonna play through the entire game. And what do I mean by the entire game? Well, there, let's go to the one player mode and I'll <coughs> and I'll explain. Now what I mean by going through the entire game is I'm going to beat the game as every single one of these characters and unlock all of and unlock all 15 hidden characters. Now the one thing I'm going to do though is I'm going to start it off in a specific order just cuz two Digimon have a weird way of unlocking something special. You'll see that when you know, once we get to it, but I think I'll start off as... <laughs> yeah, let's go in order of Season 2 and be Wormmon. Wormmon, let him have it! <laughs> <clears throat> the tr having the uh, Digimon Tamer there is almost completely pointless. It's it's fun just to see them, but they're they're pointless. They don't do anything. You're the one controlling them. Ready? Ready? Anyways, this probably had to be one of my one of my absolute favorite fighting games growing up, probably because it was one of the ones I was actually good at. Because I was never really <coughs> I was never really much of a of a fighting game buff. But this one was actually, you know, simple enough to simple enough to where anybody can do it. Oh yeah, and we have basically I'll explain all the map, you know, all the uh heads up display stuff there too we have you know your health bar your digi meter which mine is full and i'll do that in one second you have your score which is pointless except for in the case of Wormmon and Vmon, which again i'll i'll allude to once i once i get through with them and a time limit but since we have a full digi bar if you hit r1 you can digivolve and in his case it will be to stingmon and there's also cards and fun little... Oh, and she can Digivolve, too. This is great. <clears throat> and it's unfair. She has a Mega Form. I only have a champion level. And Stingmon is... He's alright, definitely. And let's... Aw, oh, you! You suck. Yeah, nice try on that one. <coughs> oh yeah, and I believe it's the best. I believe it's the... Oh my god, quit dodging! And I'll save that for next time, because it's the... It's like... It's like every other standard fight... Standard fighting game. It's the best two out of three. No, I will not settle for a time limit. <coughs> The only reason I have that on is again is for the sake of points, you, which you don't win. really matter. Ready? Rumble. Oops. Oh, L1 guards apparently Digi did not know that because I I was accidentally hitting that instead of R1, which digivolves me. And there she goes. <laughs> Bam. Yeah, his special move is kind of one of the weaker ones. Because I think Magnadramon's is a lot better. I don't know the names for for all their moves. Like, he just said his was Evil Antenna, which is fine. But, yeah, I don't know. <coughs> Come on. I want that card. Oh, yeah, I definitely want that card. That's an attack up card, which is helpful. And I'm gonna go back to Stingmon, because I believe I can finish this right here. Come here. Yeah, you ain't getting away. <coughs> One of the most messed up courses, too, because they can just. Yep, oh, there she goes right into the ice. Chan chances are, nine times out of ten, when you KO something on here, they're gonna fall on the ice. <laughs> I can even hear the water there. Wow, that was... I got a perfect there? Not bad. 
and I'll explain this. It's pretty much we're gonna face off against three Digimon, then then a mini game, which we showed you in the last in the first video. There's only three. Oh, in this course, this one's nuts just because of just because there's the real potential to fall because there there isn't that much space to work with. But no, there's three, uh... Dang, and I... Didn't think I was beating him that badly. What? Yeah, and there are course hazards here, too, such as that. And that! Yeah, and of course, every one of my opponents is gonna have a mega level as opposed to my champion. And he has missiles! And he has giant missiles! I mean, it'll be fine. But again, like I'm saying before, you know, I get so rudely interrupted and whatnot is... Is that there's the three three fights, then a, then a mini game, three more fights, and then the boss Digimon. It's the same boss every single time. Hold, still. Sorry, man. But no, and I, I know we just did a fighting game, too, in the way of Pokémon, but I mean, come on, you're comparing apples to oranges here, because A, this is a 2D, a 2D fighter, and that plays more like a 3D version of Tekken. And this one's gonna be a lot shorter, because, you know, you don't have to fight through a hundred fucking people on every league, and I'm just gonna take that. That's the that's a max digivolution digivolution item. Basically, it just fills your meter up all the way, regardless of where it's at. Yeah, get down there. Cause I want to. Oh, <laughs> I was trying to jump over the bomb. Oh my God, hold! It's so like hold still so I can hit you. Aw, oh, you jerk! I could have used that a lot more than you. Yeah, grab that. No, grab that. I don't know how much it'll actually hinder the computer character, but what that does is just m mess your controls up all over the place. And I don't mean it just reverses them. It just, it makes you go one way at one point and another at another point when you're pressing the same direction. It's not fun. <laughs> and another... Huh. I wonder if that perfect is just for not losing a fall. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> but we're gonna... We're gonna get a lot of hidden characters early on. Because the bottom ones, as you could tell, are the are the ones for all the characters. But then there's ones on top which require, you know, require things. Yeah, I could just keep doing it. I could just keep doing this. And that's the caveat with this course. Is it twists? <coughs> It could twist 180 degrees, it can twist 90, but it twists. And that, you know. I, I mean, it doesn't really change <clears throat> change any strategy. So you might have, although it does, it can interrupt the flow of battle, for sure. I don't know what triggers it, though, or if it's just completely random, because... Yeah, see, why does it... Oh, I saw, I saw. 
I just don't. I mean, I like that. <clears throat> I like that we not only get some stage variety a oh, little I bit. I mean, there's mm. only like six stages, <laughs> but each stage also Lovely. has their own has their own kind of mechanics to them as well. Like the ice stage is actually slippery, thus kind of making it tricky for a fighting game. Then there was the sky one, which electricity and it's a small it's a small stage to fight on. And then there's this, which is inside of a computer, funny enough. Oh yeah, let's do it. Bam. It's like the weakest of all the special moves. It's it's not good. Oh, no! I forgot he had that move. Yeah, and, oh, I should probably... Well, I'll explain the... I'll explain the controls in the next fight. But he, still, still not hard. I mean, realistically, this game... This game isn't hard. Oh, no perfect bonus. So did I actually get around not getting hit by the other two in the second? Oh, and now we have a mini game. Press the square button and a gauge will appear. Release the square and the Digimon will throw a ball. If the ball goes in the basket, you get a point. And I'm going to turn that down by one tick. Longer you hold it, yep, so whoever gets, so ten points wins. And you don't need to win these, but it does, you know, add a nice little boost to your score, which, again, is still kind of useless. It works in the case, of, like, it's needed in the case of this game, sort of. Ready? Rumble. And it's funny that you can kind of shoot it from the underside of the hoop, too, and... There we go. Oh, and you get a time bonus, too. That's... I had a feeling you would. So who's up next? Okay, Patamon, and I think this is where something's gonna happen, since... <clears throat> since it's the first... first playthrough on this new file, because I completely scrubbed the file from the card. Really? Not... Wait, oh, I think I know what it is. And... And I'll have to, I'll have to go back and fix that, you know, after I win this, after I win this playthrough, which I'm almost through on. Like I said, it's... Hell, every character is not that long. I'll probably be done with this long before the, uh... Oh, no! He's lifting me up! <laughs> yeah, get out of here. Good, I needed a bigger target. Yeah, I'll go down with you. It didn't hurt me anyways, so... I'm amazed the stage hazards here never really took place. Because I know they do. Such as that. Such as a box getting dropped on your head. I mean, in all honesty, there isn't too much to say about this game. It's... It's a simple fighting game with no real story like the, uh, you know, like Pokin has. Because Pokin... Ooh, that, that hurt. Because, I mean, Pokin actually... It takes forever to get there, but it actually has a pretty good story for what it is. It just, you know, takes forever to get there. This, on the other hand, has no story and doesn't really take that 
that long to get there. Oh yeah, but I've been meaning to talk about the controls too. Controls, again, pretty simple. X jumps or double jumps in, you know, if you're in the air. Circle and triangle do special moves like what you're seeing here. Everybody has a unique set. Square is punching, L1 is guarding, R1 is digivolve and special move if you're already digivolve. And yeah, that's about it. <laughs> And then there's items scattered around, such as car such as cards, food, stuff like that. And bombs. Basically they all have you know, you see what they do when I explain as we go. Wow, you're gonna be a pain to hit, aren't you? No, I didn't want you to get that. Oh, and I didn't realize the evil antenna actually restores my HP. That's... Okay, that probably makes up for the damage it causes, because it's not... Ooh, hi, and he's... Yeah, because that's fair. He can digivolve to that. Make him digivolve to XVmon, not fucking Imperial Dramon. Oh, no! Wow. Okay. I wasn't expecting Positron Laser. Oh, and the... Really? I didn't know the boulder could do that. Oh, no! No! Wow, that actually got a lot closer than I thought it would. Yeah, run him over. And this this stage doesn't really have too much in your way. It's like bold, boulders that can knock you off the field, but that's about it. Good, that could actually be helpful. I can't believe he actually got his special off on me. What are the odds? On what? You were caught. How? Yeah, fine. I'm still going to catch you anyways, you jerk. Ow, it hurts. Yeah. Oh, I was going to say grab that, please. That would have been helpful because that... That's an attack down, that's a... That's an item that, over there that lowers your Digivolution meter. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Yeah, that's what I get. I get boulders to the face for that. Oh, yeah. No! Well, at least my meter fills up pretty quick. And even their guardian isn't as broken as the Pokémon tournaments was. I think, what do I have? Two more and then the boss? <laughs> I mean, I'll st and I'll still unlock, like, what? Dang, three, no, two Digimon here. Nope! Oh, I do get it. Cool. Black War Greymon! Although this is unfair because I'm fighting Black War Greymon the entire time. How you get him, you might wonder. Just get to this point without losing. That's all. I thought it was supposed to be ab after the mini game, but I guess it's after the first fight after that. Which that's fine, but but oh yeah, that's what cuz that's what you need. And yeah, the ooh. Oh my god, quit blocking. 
evolution. <laughs> yeah, this stage is gonna be. That is funny that we got that it went from Agumon to Black War Greymon just because. Just because Agumon does digivolve into regular War Greymon, so that's kind of funny how that worked out. Yeah, I do not want to. Yeah, I do not want to get caught up in his special move, because that will mess me up something fierce. And oh, it's only a one-round thing too. That's cool. Nope, it's two. I was hoping it'd be one. That'd be nice. Darn, I was trying to get him in the lava, too, because that... My god, that lava does some damage. Yeah, go in there. Oh, yeah, and he grabbed the foot. No! Aww. <laughs> Shit. Wow, okay. Drop to fall, but that's fine. Foreign objects must be destroyed. You can lose. That's fine. That's fine, it happens. Not usually, but it happens. Yeah, I'll just keep kicking. <laughs> okay, that did some damage. Oh, come on, it's like... Come on, in the lava. Bam. Cool, now we have Black War Grandmon as a playable character. I did say there were six characters up top to unlock, and well, he's one of them. Oh, and... Oh, now we're on to Reaper... God, I lost track of what fight we were on, but... Okay. God, why is this music so good? And I'm going to have to be an aerial artist here because... Just because if you get caught in Reapermon's stuff... Oh my god, he he is OP and cheap is... Yeah, he's cheap. I don't even know if Digivolving will help me on this one, but we'll find out. Ooh, good. Good, just stay back. What? No! Oh my god. I like how he broke free of my move. No, no, no! I don't like Reapermon. He has two big moves, and they're cheap, and this is the perfect battlefield for him to use them on. No! Uh, good. Good. Get away. Because look how much damage that stuff did. That was nuts. We won. You win. That was mental how much damage he... Oh, great, and he has special, too, and that's the thing about starting off as a mega level. If you stay as mega butt to do your special, you have to have the meter filled, and then you could use it whenever you want. So, and his is pretty brutal. No. No, see, it's the... Ah! Uh, uh, yeah, and it was guaranteed to stun me, too. <laughs> Need to put 
let's see. Okay, doing fine. Too bad my moves aren't ranged. Doing this as Vmon is gonna be worse. Although Imperial Dramon is is a lot better than Stingmon, that's for sure. Ah, but I defeated him though. That wasn't nail biting at all. Well, not really, but he is hard. I remember I struggled with him a lot when I first played this game as a kid. <laughs> But I mean, hey, that's, you know, that's the game for, that's pretty much the game, but I'm not going to do any dialogue during the credits or anything, not yet, we'll do that once we're done. But no, but no, I'm going to end this video here, so until next time, as always, thanks for watching.